Hello everyone, welcome back to Balatro. We are working our way through collecting and unlocking everything in the collection, and I was just looking through stuff to focus on today, and we are going to see if at any point during the run we can beat a boss blind with a high card. So that is our supplemental objective, as well as just trying to win today. Let's start with... Let's try, let's try the abandoned deck, shall we? Start the run with no face cards in your deck. So our deck, if we look, is really skinny. Only 36 cards, no face cards. We do have the aces. Let's see what we can do with this. Right, so... Must remember, we need five cards for a straight or a flush. No fives, no sevens. So, just a pair of eights not super strong let's keep these straight flushy looking spades see if we can do something with that we can't really but we can play two pairs tens and nines for a start 116 points then right here we have a full house Now, I'm assuming the earlier we try, uh, four times multi every five hands played, times four multi, not four multi, times four of your multi, or gain four dollars at the end of each turn. I think we have to go for Golden Joker just to get some early funding. Uh, but the sooner we try and beat a boss blind with a high card, the better, because when you get really high up in the levels, the numbers get so big, it's much harder to have that kind of fine control. Right, we could play a pair of eights, or we could go fishing for another heart. Which we do not find. Alright, now we could go fishing for a straight flush. Which we still don't find. Goody. All right, what can we do with what we have left? Two pair, nines and fives. Uh, still no fives for a straight. So it's just going to be a pair of eights. Two pair, nines and sevens. We'll hopefully get us over the line. Just barely. Alright, we get a bit of extra cash. We're going to need it. Trigger each card in your final hand twice. Random multi. All right, we're going up against our first boss, so I'll take whatever I can get. Especially because in our final hand, we could play a high card and that high card might be doubled twice. So, 600. Let's start with a baby full house. That's not bad. We got three chances to get high card to win. Let's play a pair of deuces. We'll get us a bit closer. Okay. High card, ace. Oh, that'll do it. So that is that unlock done. Nice and early. Now we can just try and focus on winning. Mad Joker, four of a kinds are going to happen more often because we have fewer cards to pick through. Um, and we can go for spades as well, I guess. Right. Eight, seven, wait, we can do ten, nine, eight, seven, six for a straight. Get those spades going. 840 right away. Extra cash, love to see it. Adds double the rank of the lowest card held to hand multi and plus one hand size. Now, we can't accommodate both. But I think if we toss the golden joker now and take this. Doubles the rank of the lowest card held in hand to multi. Adds multi, trigger stuff twice. 10 for 4 of a kind. Okay, so we don't need to worry about the ordering right now on those, I don't think. So we're now drawing 9 cards because of the juggler. 
and we want to play spades and four of a kinds, which is pretty niche. Let's throw out the smaller stuff. We can play two pair deuces and threes. Throw the nine out. We'll get a 20 multiplier for this 10 being doubled to 20. Then we can just play a four house tens for the aces for the tens. That'll be just fine. Take my cash. Abstract joker plus two for each joker or plus ten. One in ten chance to self implode. Let's see. Misprint is random. Whereas this is always plus twelve. Because we have six jokers so we'll take that I don't think we need the banana right now heart cards are debuffed that's a lot of heart cards um right, let's play trip threes get rid of the other two small cards so this seven becomes a 14 multiplier And we'll play a pair of eights. And the spade will get some multiplier. And this will be plus 20, which is real strong. Club's actually no good to us, but I think just playing this full house will get us to 1600 quite nicely. I'm just having such a good time playing this game, man. I'm excited once we've got, like, kind of... 90% of the collection unlocked, really going after the kind of challenge of what remains to unlock is going to be a great old time. Select two cards to enhance to multis, or glass cards give an extra five. We have no glass cards, we have no room for this, but I will just take the grabber for an additional hand to play each round. Right, seems like there should be a straight here, but there's not because there's no five and there's no nine. So, as ever, we'll just play the smallest stuff with a pair to get a 14x multiplier off the 7. I'll play two pairs, 7s and 8s. What I really want to do is get some planet cards, uh, sorry, some tarot cards to convert some of these suits over. What is that? Not discovered. Earn $10 if played hand triggers... The boss blind ability. Plus one joker slot. Negative. I've never seen a negative before. So I can't buy this. I can buy this. So I don't have to have the joker slot to put it into. It just creates its own joker slot. And so it just... Obviously, if I remove it, I will lose that additional joker slot. But if we go into... Run in footnote, uh, collection and additions, negatives plus one joker slot. I've never seen that before, but now I know what that's about. Interesting. Well, that was our money spent immediately, but seems worthwhile. But earn ten dollars if played hand triggers the boss blind ability. We'll see more of that later. For now, give me the baby two pair, multiply that by 14. Then give me trips here. Multiply that by 16. And give me two pairs, fives and tens. Multiply that by 14. Give me some cash. There's the stencil again. 3x if a joker was bought. There's Fortune Teller. Unfortunately, I don't think we can really cycle through a whole lot of stuff without a fixed plan. So, subtract discards from multi. And $10 if the played hand triggers the Bloss Blind ability. I'm not sure how exactly that's going to work. 
is obviously the discards are going to be subtracted from the multi but at the same time the hand isn't the thing that's doing that on this occasion oh no we get the 10 bucks I'll take it um, let's play a pair of 8s we get another 10 bucks this is great so long as we can actually win discard all this little stuff let's go full house tens full of fives with the 7 to a 14 multiplier alright that is some great funding plus 20 chips for odd ranked played cards Plus one multi per consecutive hand played without a face card. Well, well, well. What don't we have any of? All right, so it's going to be low to start, but it's going to pick up quickly. I think Mad Joker can go. I don't think it's doing anything for us. So that is plus one multi. We don't have anything multiplying our multis, so we don't mind about that right now. Let's re-roll a bit. Three of a kind. Tarot. Plus 15 multi when three or fewer cards are played. So that would be trips, basically. All right, let's get rid of this. Let's buy this. Trigger each card in final hand of round two times when played. Let's get rid of this as well. Take this. And see how that goes. I feel like this is going to be way, way, way stronger. So we want to play three or fewer cards and keep our discards around. So a pair of threes worth 3,000 to us sure thing um a pair of tens worth four thousand to us i think that's gonna go well um bootstraps plus one multi for every five dollars you have okay I can't get rid of this that has to stay just because it's its own benefit this is worth times 12 to us. No, this is worth more. This is worth 14 because we have seven jokers. All right, let's get rid of juggler because we're only playing three card hands now. We don't need as many cards to make a hand out of. So there's a pair of fives. And this is just taking up one extra multi every time we play a hand. So this is going to get real interesting. I think we're going to need some like polychrome cards to go really late game. Holographic. Two times multi if your deck has at least 16 enhanced cards. We do not have enhanced cards right now. And because we have bootstraps, I don't really want to spend my money, although I will get enhanced car or enhanced jokers more frequently play only one hand score at least four thousand one hand what is that hand gonna be we want double fist to go big abstract joker will be fine plus is fine we want to play only three cards oh god we could play a pair of fours right now Because here's the thing, we can't play. Okay, so we, what we probably want to play is trips, right? We probably want to play trips. Three of a kind, 20 times three. One pair, 10 times two. So we probably want to go fishing for a bigger card. Now, of course, if I spend my discards, 
our banner isn't going to be as worth as much to us. And we want whatever our smallest card to be to be a very big card for the purposes of doubling. Nine or a seven. Nine or a seven. We get the nine. So we can play trip nines. It will only be four X on this. But we have no discards. We can only play one hand. This is probably the best hand we have to play. Let's hope we get 4,000 points. We do not. We get two and a half thousand. Damn. Any unlocks? Yes, we beat a boss with a high card as we went into. Ballot. On earth is ballot. Uh, we've unlocked Half Joker now. We've seen Ride the Bus. Had such potential, but not today. Uh, we've seen the Matador. In negative. Oh, we haven't played Ballot yet, so we can't actually see what it does until we play, or until we buy it. Okay. All right. Well, I'm gonna cut that one short today, just because if I record another one and we go towards a finish, we could be well over an hour. So a short one for you today, but join me tomorrow. We'll have another one right at the same time for you. Thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying these as much as I am. I'm having a great time. Otherwise, questions, comments can go down below. You can also find a link to the Discord. If you have the demo yourself, you can click it here, or there'll be a link down in the description if you want to find that. Otherwise, thanks again. I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.